Prince Harry upset. He and Meghan Markle can't join William and Kate at Balmoral. Prince Harry is understood to be frustrated. The coronavirus pandemic has prevented him visiting Balmoral Castle with the rest of the royals, with William and Kate having arrived on Friday. Prince Harry is upset. He can't fly over from the U.S. to join his family at Balmoral for the annual summer trip. It has been claimed. Prince William and Kate Middleton arrived along with the kids at the Royal Estate at Aberdeenshire on Friday, where they saw the Queen and Prince Philip for the first time in months. But why the Duke of Sussex is understood to be frustrated that he's stuck in California due to the coronavirus pandemic? Wife Meghan Markle is reportedly more content. She doesn't feel like she's missing out. An insider told in Touch Weekly, she's been too busy decorating the new Montecito mansion. Back in March, the Sussexes accepted an invitation to the Highland Castle for the late summer reunion, but the COVID-19 hampered their plans, and the Sunday Times previously reported. It comes after news Harry, 35, is set to miss the high-profile King Power Royal Charity Polo Day at the end of September. He and William, 38, have taken part in the event, which raises millions for charity for the past 15 years. Harry's absence has further fueled rumors of the rift between the two brothers. However, on Saturday, in a Zoom call to mark Rugby League's 125th third birthday, the Duke say that early coronavirus pandemic has stopped him from returning to the UK. In the Zoom quiz of players, coaches and volunteers from the sport, she also vowed to fly home for the Rugby League World Cup next year. Speaking from his Santa Barbara mansion, the Duke of Sussex said, We've got a whole rugby glitch World Cup upcoming next year. I definitely plan on coming back. I would have been back already had it not been for COVID. Harry and Meghan's move into the $11.1 million pounds. pounds. Harry and Meghan's move into the $11.1 million pounds night bed pad in Montecito. Santa Barbara saw them take out a 7.25 million pound mortgage after getting some financial help from Prince Charles. The property also includes a library, cinema, gym, spa, and sauna, as well as 16 bathrooms. A source told in Touch Weekly, Harry prefers his new neighborhood to Los Angeles where the pair initially lived on arriving in the west. Harry doesn't know the area well at all, but so far so good, the source say. Santa Barbara is more his scene than LA. He has the freedom and space he needs. Harry was extremely unhappy in LA.